Hey guys, welcome to Echocalypse Scarlet Covenant. Ever wondered uh, how to create your own uh, burn team? So we will initially do a burn team with the current roster or the current roster of characters that we have for the game. Since the game is still new, apparently your burn team will not have future units, but this could be your initial team already. So we'll start off with classifying what is really a burn team. So let's look at the definition for Rayon here. So, burn is, okay, take a debuff damage equal to a certain percentage of the caster's attack each round and dealing that damage, okay? So, more or less, each of the caster have their certain percentage, um, as you can see here, with Rayon, it's 60%, but if you move to the other burn... Uh, characters that I have it's going to be different so for Ferencia it's going to be 20% so again a a debuff damage equal to a certain percentage of the casters attack each round so the damage is each, is each round so it's kind of a damage over time debuff okay so why do we want this this is of course additional damage aside from the damage that you do per turn and there are certain stages that you know or certain battles that your burn can become your last uh you know your last damage before your enemy dies so that is why we are going with a burn team so again we will be going to the different components of the burn team so um first one are you going to be your main dps who are they what do they do I'm gonna go back to rayon here rayon is actually the best burn component or burn character that you'll be needing in this game let's go through her skills guys so she has she can apply burn so this one scales from 50 now I am at 100% with 4 stars on locks. But with 50 guys, that is still a good percentage because you're not going to be bringing her uh, for, for the application of burn. But you have other characters with burn as well. So right now, with her basic attack, I can apply 100. But the base application is a 50% with 63 physical damage to the front row enemies. Okay, so her special is going to be a lot of damage starting with your base uh you know base level one so dealing damage physical damage to all enemies with extra true damage of six percent so this scales as you level it up and the true damage that does not exceed 120 percent of rayon's attack now that I have opened up up to three star, there are additional, um, you know, additional uh, perks to this skill. Her crit rate and crit damage are increased by 20% and she ignores any armor and resistance bonus when attacking units with burn. So that is why she is very, very, very good in terms of your primary DPS for your burn team. So moving on to her passive, so submit to the Majesty of Sovereign before taking action. Each enemy with burn, Rayon gets one stack of Thunderbolt lasting the entire battle. So if she stays long, she gets she gets to stack all of these up to 15 stacks. So this is um, what she gets. So Thunderbolt is attack, crit rate, strength, plus 1%. That is at tier 2. But um, passives are easy to scale up. So you're easily going to go up to tier 6. So it's going to be plus 3 at tier 6. The only hurdle for each of the characters is leveling up the special skill. Because this requires copies. But again, even for level 1, level one or level 2, I don't think it would be a problem. So that is her. So she is our primary DPS. Kind of your primary DPS as well would be Shiyu. So Shiyu and um, her, 
will go hand in hand. Shiu though is going to be more of your um, DPS slash tank. She has revived to herself and I usually put her in the front. So we'll look at uh, more on what they call this, more on deployment and strategy turns later. So let's go over her skills first. So she has, for her basic, she has uh, damage to the back row, absorbing 8% of their armor and resistance for run round. Her special though would be applying burn. So this is 50% with zero stars at level one. Right now I am at 60% and she also has an increased dodge for, for herself and surrounding units for run round for every enemy with burn. So again, burn the burn component doesn't add just additional you know additional damage additional damage over time but for rayon again it enhances her damage for her it enhances her dodge so there are additional add-ons to a specific ca character depending on who you use obviously um and her passive is she is going to be can can be revived at 40% of max HP and gains 4 rage when she is up again. So this is actually crucial because you'll be placing her in our, in the front. So that is it for Shiyu and for Rayon. Both of them will be your primary DPS. Um, other components to this team. Um, either you bring Firencia or you're going to be bringing Winnow. We we'll go first with Ferencia. Ferencia will be your secondary DPS. Um, she is going. She, she's not gonna deal much damage, but she is decent in that area. So uh, that is her. Uh, what do you call this? Her attack. So this is forty percent chance of uh, transfer one attribute debuff to targets, and. This one is with a 30% chance to transfer one attribute debuff to target. So again, we will have an increase from 30 to 40 here. For her special skill though, so this is just a simple one at a zero stars at level one. So applying burn for two rounds, which is nice because you get to retain that damage for two rounds. But as you get copies of her, if I will be unlocking at level three, so apply silent to targets already with burn for one round. So additional debuff aside from your burn. I'm actually looking forward to getting a copy of her so that I could unlock this as well. So that is it up to more or less the future levels of her kit. For her passive here. So when receiving the first rage reduction effect from an active attack, it restores rage to four instead. So very simple kit, not really impressive. She's just there to apply burn and to apply silent, more or less for her, you know, bag of tricks. An option as well, uh, but I didn't, I, I tried using Winnow before. If you don't have Ferencia if, and if re, you prefer Winnow, she's also okay, but I prefer Ferencia because there are a lot of debuffs more on her kit. For her, she has a simple attack, so this is just reducing crit resistance. Next up, her special is going to be... So single row, 60%, apply 50 to start, and 60 to apply bird for run round for one row. Nothing special. Her passive though, if you want a guaranteed burn every turn, so she is going to be your character that you that you need to add. But this is going just going to be it's going to be one character aside from the start. So at the start of the battle, she gets two random enemies for one round. But consecutive rounds will only be for one random enemy. So again, not that special of a kit. Um, I'd rather bring Ferencia again instead of her. Uh, I tried bring all four of them. So Rayon, Shiyu, and Ferencia. It doesn't really, you know, does really matter. So I took out Winnow and replaced her with, uh, you know, with other characters, which we'll be talking later. So my main three. Uh, that I'm using would be Shiyu, Ferencia, and Rayon for 
your you know your core burn team so next up is aside from them you will be needing to bring levitin not sure i read that right but this is your neolith this neolith is actually applying burn as well with a 40 percent chance so it increases as you get copies of the neolith so i suggest you level this up as well so three random enemies this is actually a good surplus for you to add more burn effects because you'll be needing a lot of burn effects as you go to the final character which we'll describe later in terms of the formation the other one that you might want to level up as a preparation or as a preparation for future use would be gandiva this one is also a nice one but you'll have to level this up either replace the first one or you carry both of them to ensure that you apply more burn to your enemies okay so that is initially the burn concept of the team um we'll be putting it all together later and uh, more or less that the if i'm bringing three of them so the rest would be ideally for support the next lot it could be any um deep another dps probably if you so choose and, and a debuffer so for the debuffer category we have zawa here zawa is going to be offering up blind i don't want to go to the kit i just want to you know um explain what they're going to be bringing to my team so she brings blind i also am bringing levia for this team because of rage she gives a lot of rage she is a fantastic dps as well so and the last one that i am using is actually chiraha so chira as you all know familiar i think with the previous you know banner that she has she has heals she has shield she has revived so all in one support that is why i need her okay so let's go to the um the deployment strategy so this is how you deploy them love you out the front because you want to have rage on your first turn for anybody that she can apply it to so it's still rng it's not guaranteed but again she is nice to have as your rage applier she here is again your dps slash tank uh she has self revived shiraha here is also a nice one again for your front line the rest at the back is more of like for example for Ferencia. at this point Ferencia applies for example applies your burn um it's going to go for two rounds it's going to reach rayon once it reaches rayon she can actually apply this one the the damage that i mentioned so this one has a bigger damage if your enemies are actually already burned so that is why rayon is actually on the last one and if you can remember this is levatin so it's actually placed in the front because you want to activate it first because after um levatin uh, sorry after ferentia activates then your neolith activates which is actually in preparation for rayon as well so you have one two three burn opportunities before rayon takes her turn zawa is just here for additional debuffs but again rayon takes the cake here with um her special skill that is why you will need rage as early as the first round and hopefully you can you know get to have rage faster because you have levia here the other option for rage if you're asking me if you don't have levia is going to be audrey so where's audrey here okay audrey is your other option for rage so more or less uh she's an option it depends upon how you build your own team um again this component actually is flexible your main considerations here that you should think about is just rayon and shiu the rest are flexible for your burn team but i would suggest at least three or four 
burn characters to synergize with all of your burn team. The rest is more or less for support for the whole concept. Okay, so with all that said, let's go to a demo, guys, with uh, at least one combat round. So I still have some unfinished rounds here. Let's let's finish these before going forward. This needs to be three starred. So we're gonna be using my burn team. So again, this is the we're gonna use a one speed so that you can see the sequence of events that happens where I you know um, at least you know why I put the characters there. So first and foremost, Levia. So they she actually gave, gave them rage you have ferentia there with burn she doesn't apply it so nobody has burn because they are already dead so more or less again it's still rng to apply burn so again rage then you have shio there at the back you apply burn Sadly, Rayon doesn't have four rage, so she doesn't have her special, but she gives a lot of, you know, a lot of burn here for the front line. So additional damage as well. So let's just wait for these two, you know, to finish. So again, it's crucial that you have a very good support for additional survivability. Especially for the front line, especially if you're waiting for additional damage to take out. As you can see there, Rayon has a lot of damage and more damage if your enemies have burn. So I think I, could, I, I cannot clear this in 3 stars, but it, it's worth the demo for these guys. So we'll do another demo here in which um, on the first turn... Rayon can do... Let's do something here. Okay. Let's just try this out here. In which Rayon can do her special skill. So again, you have Levia for her special. So again, at the back, Rage is full. Ferencia applies burn. Another burn, which is four. Then Rayon will have her special applying a lot of damage to those who are burned. So, as you can see, that is more or less, that is your ideal first turn. Um, most of the time it happens, but again, uh, it really depends if Rayon gets rage and you just, you know, burn happens to your team. The important thing is Rayon just gets that, you know, last two rage on the first turn, then I think it would be easier for you. So, that is your burn team guys so i hope that you were able to enjoy that team i'm actually enjoying carrying that team this team so if you have some questions please put it down in the comment section i'm sure down the road um this burn team will have a different look but for now this is the best burn team i think that i could put together so thank you very much guys for staying this far take care stay safe this is the warden and i'm out of here